Welcome, this is the Quantum Business Healing for the quarter of January, February and March. I'd like to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Okay, Leo's, 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 Leo's. So we have protection. You, um, you, your loved ones are protected and safe and protected by Evan. So whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring, Leo, protection is here for you. So let's see your energies. There's a whole lot of ones, odd number. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Seven. Oh, it's a masculine. Oh, it is so masculine, ladies and gentlemen. So masculine. Okay, so um, ladies and gentlemen, this is a masculine quarter. No decision. Do not make any decision about work and career um, in the month of um, October, November, and December, okay? It's a masculine, it's an, a no um, quarter to make any sort of a decision. There is no positive energies, and your major arcana is in the reverse, okay? The only major arcana is in reverse, so it's as if you, Leos, are dealing with some sort of an issue, October, make no decision, okay? And November, um, conflicts and competition. December, no decision. Ace of Cups is in reverse. Some of you are dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, Boss. Um, it is in reverse. The only thing that is positive is some sort of a um, victory and success, okay? And we are going to be seen with an extended um where is this victory and success is coming from because i see no love especially if you are um your boss is a pisces cancer or scorpion i do not see this person is going to be there for you leos okay so if you're dealing with any water sign bosses business people um, I see no victory and success for you and this person for the rest of you leos is going to be good um um, if the rest, if you Leos are doing any business with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, there is no success for you guys. The rest of you Leos, yes, uh, there is uh, going to be some sort of a success that is going to be coming in victory and success. But for um the people who are connected, whether in um um it's your boss or this person has uh, um worked together with you. Um, water sign people, you Leos have uh, absolutely no happiness or no successful event with these water sign people. Okay, for the rest of you Leos who are dealing with all the fire sign people, um, in business and career, it's going to be good, but with water sign people, it's not going to be successful. Some of you, if your boss, um, this person is not, you see, some of you have been. Um, doing some sort of a competition with this person and this person if it's your boss or your supervisor you have been playing some sort of a game and trying to compete against this person this person is not really liking it but they're not saying anything and they're going to be setting you up big time and I don't think it's really setting you up it's just uh, standing above whatever you're doing okay because a lot of you leos are trying to compete against a boss or a supervisor this person is not really taking it nicely so um if um i were you i would just stand back because this person some sort of reorganization is coming up and this person is going to re uh, making decision they are the last person to make a decision about you leo so um, you got to be aware of what is happening and transpiring. So I want to say to each and every person, thank you. Thank you for being here. Um, thank you for supporting um, this channel. Please remember to like and share these videos. Thumbs up is good. Um, share, and, share and thumbs up is good. Um, this quartal is a quartal where it is a very hot quartal. Um, it's a masculine quartal. It's people using their, their egos. It's people um, coming up in a competition against you for whatever reason. 
and uh, um, you could be having you could be a, a com um, having competition against other people. Don't do it because you it's not going to be working out in your favors, Leo. And I'm and I'm telling you this because it's not looking good for you, Leos, with the competition. Let it go. All righty. So that's in the balance, the foundation of what is transpired is in the foundation. The rest of you business people, especially you business um, Leo people, is going to be having some sort of a protection. Um, whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring, a lot of you business people are going to be having some sort of a protection. And the victory and success they're saying is coming up for business people. If you have a business, you're going to be victorious and successful. And your business and uh, your whole existence is going to be protected. So be aware of this. So let's go and look at each month. Remember to go back and look at the bi monthlies after you finish listening to this reading, Leos. Because the bi monthlies will let you know the two last week is the beginning of October. And that is going to let you know what is happening, what is transpiring in the beginning of October, the two first weeks in October. Um, so you can check, use that to, to check it out until the October readings comes out. All right. So what we're seeing here, ladies and gentlemen, is the energy of the magician. The energy of the magician in business is always about it's, yes, it's a green light to go. No, not in the month of October. No, no, no. Do not make any sort of a decision in the month of October in business and career. It's not going to be working out. Some of you, um, I see that if uh, um, you had a, um, a supervisor, a secretary or so, that is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion. This person is turning their backs on you in the month of October. So if you have a business partner or you are collaborating with this person, whoever this person is, they're going to be moving forward and turning their backs on you. So you have to be aware of this because this is going to be coming up. So um, do not be surprised um, um, if this person, um, works in your team and they said, um, I'm leaving in the month of October. Okay. So, um, be realistic and be aware of what is happening and transpire. You can't, uh, um, change the way people think and feel, um, whoever this person is, this person is between the age of 18 and 45. And you could have been working with this person for a very long time, or you are collaborating with this person. And I see that this person is going to be deciding to move out on their own. So, Leo, be aware of this and um, get ready for this, okay? Because um, a transition is definitely, definitely coming in for you, Leo. So there is some sort of a, it's not a good month in October. In October, it is better to stay clear of making any sort of a changes and transition to money, your business, career, wealth, and finance. Um, it's not a go, okay? The energy of the magician is in reverse. So be aware of this. So um, then when we look at the month of uh, hmm, November, there's a whole lot of competition that is going on. Uh, competition between um, a scorpion. Um, a whole lot of competition is as if you're going up against a whole lot of competition. So if it's at work competition on the work floor, if, if it's your own busy competition, if you're applying for a job competition, okay, people are, um, comp, um, you know, competing against you. And however this is coming up and it's transpiring, I see a whole lot of a competition and you could be competing against a whole lot of people and it's not going to do you any good, Leos. And this is going to be coming up in November. Whatever is happening and transpire, there's huge competition that is happening and is transpiring. And you need to understand, Leo, it's not all about comp um, competing against other people. Because when you're competing against other people, it's because you're unsure of yourself. This is why you want to be always the first and on top. And that is only showing your ego. Okay, this is this is about you using your ego to control a situation, conflicts over the work floor, conflicts with other people, trying to 
um, take over other people um, work and, and workflow and position and that sort of a thing that is not going to be looking good on you Leo's going forward and you can see this happening because uh, um, it's as if whatever you do and whatever competition you're trying to do a lot of people are not really do not like that and 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 a lot of you are going to be finding out and realizing that you have uh, um, stab yourself in your own finger um you've definitely stab yourself in your own finger leos and be aware of this because i see this sort of a situation and energy is going to be coming up where a lot of you leos are going to be um creating some sort of a situation where people or in the future is going to be whatever you do in the month of November could affect you, uh, Leos, in the future. Okay, where people are going to be like, okay, I don't know, but I am going to decide to go with someone else. So be aware of this, Leo, what you're doing, what you're giving out, what you're showing people in these last uh, months, especially in a month of november and whatever or whatever you pick up this reading because this reading is for a three months period it is showing you what you're dealing with and a lot of you leo are trying to compete against people and um to be honest some people just don't really um know that you do exist so whatever you're doing and trying to do some sort of a competition it's not going to be working out so be aware of that then we see in the month of december the month of december is not looking um very good um for the, the people who are um employ employers or employees co-workers it's not looking very good for you guys there is some sort of an uncertainty about um you moving forward in the next year whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring there is a huge uncertainty that is going to be happening and transpiring and you're going to be uh, aware of what is happening and what is transpiring so um you know open up yourself to this energy and realize what is happening be aware and alert of what is transpiring and what is coming up so that you can be understanding of how um situation is going to be happening for you um in the next year because the next year you're ending this year because a lot of you Leos has been going through a lot of stuff. Um, be um, clear of a um, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person, whoever this person is. Be aware and clear of this person so that you understand what is transpiring and what is happening because you have to be on top of your game and know exactly the situation that is happening and transpiring. So there is... Um, um, just a whole lot that is happening and transpiring and you have to be aware of the decision that you make in these three months that is coming up because it's going to be affecting you. Business people, again, it's going to be very, very um, good. Depends on um, your business people. If your business people have any association with water sign people, it's not going to be good. For the rest of the business people who are working with the earth people, um, the uh, air people, it will be good. But once you're working with water sign people, it is not really looking good for you guys. Whatever the issue, the situation is, is as if you're clearing karmas uh, between these people. I want to say thank you so much for being here. Please remember to like and thumbs up these videos. Um, this is a three month period. It is uh, whenever you pick up uh, these reading, you have to be alert about what is happening and what is transpiring so that you can prepare yourself for the shift and changes that is going to be coming in. There is an extended to this reading. If you would like to see what is going to be happening to all of these energies, there is an extended. Use the link below in order to get to my website in order to clear and see what is coming up. 15% of three readings is always to look at the two months before and um, coming up in this portal reading. So please use it and understand where you are, what you're doing and how you can create uh, stability in your world. Again, go Leos, please like and share, thumbs up and I'm saying namaste until next time.